Hey YouTubers, uh, I'm going to show you today a way you can install themes on your phone without having to go to Cydia. Um, it's an application called Icon Harvester and it's available in the Big Boss repo for $4.99. It is a little pricey but I think it is well worth the money. Let me wipe my screen off just a little bit. It's got something on it. Okay. I've had a terrible time this, today trying to get this video going. I've done it four times on the computer, so I'm now resorting to just the old-fashioned method, so bear with me. Uh, this is a theme that I put on my phone just previously in another video that did not work. So, right here on my springboard, there's an icon called Icon Harvester. Let's open it up. Okay. Now, here is a list of all the themes that I have on my phone right now. Let it build that thing, that list. This is the list of themes that's on my phone that I could go into Winterboard and select right at this time and respring and put them on my phone. Okay, here is a list of over 300 themes that's on that that's in this application. And this is list is growing daily. And you can see it's quite a lengthy list. Like I said, there's over 300 of them. And they're adding daily. Alright, so what we're going to do, we're going to add Avant 2 just for demonstration purposes right here. And that's what it will look like. If you like that theme, then all you would do is hit this install button up here, let it build that theme, and then you would go into Winterboard, select it, respring, and you would have it. But you can actually scroll through and see what they'll look like. Okay, I sort of like this one here, so let's do this one. Okay, you hit install, confirm, and it takes it just a minute to build it, and you can see that down here at the bottom there's a line going across the screen as it's building that theme. It will scroll through the different icons as it's building it also. And while it's building that, let me invite you over to iPhoneCaptain.com or iPhone4Noob.com. That's iPhone, the number 4, Noob, N-O-O-B.com. And you can see it's populating a list of 191 icons. That's probably the number of icons on my springboard at the time. So whatever how many you have on there here to populate those if they are available. So as you see you can scroll through and you can select the different whichever one you want. Let's choose that one. Here's my Apple store. I like the original one. And you just go on down through here and choose whichever ones you like. You know, and as you go down through there, you just select it, it puts it in the line, and when you exit out, it will build that customized the way you want it. Alright, so now let's go to Winterboard. And the quickest way for me to get there is just like this. Alright, now I'm going to see that I have Swab HD on there and I'm going to select both of those, the customized icons and the others as well. This, this customized is the ones that I chose, so you'll want to put that on there, check mark, or you won't get those. Respring. And when it comes back up, you're going to have Suave HD on your 
springboard. So come on over, ladies and gents, to iPhoneCaptain.com and iPhone4Noob.com. Anything that I do a video on or anything that I think is uh, important to the iPhone or iDevice community, I post it on my on one or both of my websites and my iPhone Captain website as I do videos it it adds them in real time so you won't miss one if you uh, bookmark iPhone Captain you'll actually catch every single video that I do and it says I have a sync in progress I don't know what that's all about but anyway that's my new swap. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Come over to my website. I'll put them in the description as well. Thanks for watching.